The unofficial start of summer with America's new favorite pastime, pickleball. And we're going to play coming up. Well, some of us are. But <laughs> right now, Susan Spungen is here with recipes from her new cookbook, Veg Ford, that puts summer produce front and center. Susan, thank you so much for joining us. Now, not only does this look good, it's going to taste good, I'm sure, because you want your food to taste good, but it's also important for the look, for Absolutely. it to look good. So what is your number one tip to make your food look great? Well, this book is really about vegetables, and vegetables are naturally beautiful. And uh, they're exciting, and they have, like, form and color. So I just like, really try to get as much enticing color and texture into my food as I can. You know I can tell this is good because they're not eating. They just pick it up the That's pork. Right. <laughs> they're already <laughs> tasting. Yeah, we're already tasting. <laughs> so the, the first thing we're going to do is our smoky corn salad, mm -hmm. which is all finished here. And my, my t big tip for this is like, we have this creamy feta dressing, which is delicious. Oh. Doesn't always make the prettiest finish though. So uh -huh. what we're going to do is keep some of our vegetables undressed. Okay. Undressed. Undressed. And then we mm -hmm. just add some of those <laughs> at the end. <laughs> keep, keep the jokes. This is morning television, folks. Yeah. Here, you can go for the, the last thing. That's the charred scallions. Yeah. Come on, Scotty. Come on Get out. out of Come here. on out. Don't be so Okay. Handless. And then we've got a little bit of feta. Yeah. And that goes on the top. And then, you know, the whole thing mixes up Looks as delicious. people take it, right? Yeah. And then we're going to go for a little bit of smoked paprika mm. to add some oh. smoky now that flavor. Does look good. And it looks good, right? right. How's it How taste? You, it, it tastes, tastes delicious. Good. How do you get the smoky taste well, in the okay, corn? Well, okay, three things. That you're, if you have a grill, and you could do it in the oven if you, re if you need, really needed to. You're charring the scallions, you're charring a jalapeno, and you're getting the corn really brown okay. on the grill in that package mm. with some butter. And then the smoked paprika in the salad, also just all those things make it kind of smoky. So next thing we have is our soca. Have you ever seen or heard of soca? No, before? I haven't. Okay, soca with roast sheet pan, roasted ratatouille. So a soca is a chickpea pancake. That's what oh. this is. And when it comes out of the pan, it's hot and delicious. You can eat it just as it is. Let people tear it, have keep it with it drinks. Undressed. You can, keep it undressed. <laughs> you can leave it undressed. Yeah. And then on this one, we're using goat cheese, which um, that one was feta. This yeah. is got, gonna have goat cheese all over it. I'm gonna, you wanna try to so, Yeah, do I can that? do that. Yeah. While I do this, talk to us a little about presentation, because this is beautiful. And even if I could pull off cooking this, how do you make it look this good when you're having a party? Well, I feel like I've like designed the recipes to look good. So Ooh. all you have to do is follow the recipes and follow the plating instructions and your food will look beautiful too. Because I don't just like pretend that the salad looks like that. I actually put that in the instructions. Oh. You're saying that I can actually make my food look this good? hundred percent. I appreciate your <laughs> confidence. In and then for this vegetable mix, like, you know, go for the little zucchini and the little eggplant because they just look cuter. <laughs> right? If you only have big ones, it's fine. All right, you don't need, yeah, that's great. So just remember. <laughs> you said that like you messed it up. Move out the way, kid. <laughs> this is fine. Either way, all you have to do is even crumble it. But I didn't, we don't want to Well, get if that it on looks like hand. that, I just cover it with it's gonna vegetables. It's going to be exactly. there you go. And so what, when this is all warm, the soca is warm, the vegetables are warm, it just gets all creamy and melted, and it's just delicious. And then we've got um, chickpeas in here that are also roasting. They get a little bit crispy. Crispy and it's really good. Add some protein. This one is like vegetarian, ready to go. You want to chef it up? Oh my god, it's scaring me. Oh. Right, how about yeah? And then it's kind of like a pizza, but you could also tear. Let's do. You want to do this, Michael? Tear up some basil leaves on top. Okay. I think yeah. You just wanted to put the knife down. I think you just wanted me to put the knife down. That's pretty, right? right? There you go. And then it's kind of like a pizza. You could have this for appetizers, or are you gonna try it? Oh, yeah, I'll try it. Yeah. Do not have to ask. Give it to Lindsay. Yeah, bring, She'll bring try anything. Here, this, you know, All the right. vegetables are good. But, now, but. the next one, the next one I'm excited about because this is for the, you know, the presentation perfectionist. <laughs> Sheet pan roasted ratatouille. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Ooh. Isn't that beautiful? Ooh. Yes. Yeah. But how do you but how do how do you make this next this year? How do you make this like it looks so Instagram worthy? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Actually this when I put this on my Instagram, it did very well. Okay, so a galette is what we're making here, which is a free form pie. Okay. As yeah. it were. Yeah. And um, these are beautiful in their simplicity. 
and their rusticity and their imperfection. So, all right. how do we make it? All right, so we've got our dough already rolled <laughs> up. This one's done in a skillet because they tend to leak all over the place. We're putting some flour on the bottom. This is going to absorb all the juices from. All right, we got to put sugar. No. Sugar, put the sugar, sugar before sugar. Oh, on the oh, there we go. Go. And here, mix it up. Eddie, We're gonna mix like it up. All that sugar, don't and then you? just Eddie. dump it in. It tastes good. There we go. There just we go. Dump the dump whole thing in there. In there. Spread it out a little. Look at that. <laughs> get the sugar get in the there. Good part. All right, I'm gonna yeah, spread good. it out just a little bit. Look at that. And peach it just came into season. Right. And then anybody can do this. You could just go ahead. Just take, fold it over yeah. like that. Just fold All right, it over. We, we, we have run out of time. Oh, you no. fold it like that. How long do you bake it? Oh, about an hour. Hour. You throw some of these. Well, yeah. We yeah. brush it with oh, some yeah, water. Brush it. We ran out of time. <laughs> well, you know what? We we you you can you know what you can scan the QR code on the screen to can get all these recipes on goodmorningamerica.com and as yeah. Susan said if you go to her book you can make it look just like she did because yeah. she not only tell you how to make it she tell you how to make it look beautiful and her cookbook veg ford it is out tomorrow Susan thank you so much thanks Please for having me that. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.